Hi, I'm Renee Suzanne of Renee Suzanne Coaching. Today, I'm here to talk to you about Mr. Almost. Mr. Almost is super fun, and there are two different kinds of Mr. Almost. There is the, he's not perfect, so I'll pass Mr. Almost, and then there's deal breaker Mr. Almost. The first kind, the he's not perfect kind, is just maybe a little bit short of what you want. Maybe he is literally too short. Maybe he's not educated enough or successful enough and you're holding out for the George Clooney of your city. Well, good luck with that unless you're a 22 year old supermodel, in which case, congratulations, have fun and you probably will find Mr. Perfect. For the rest of us, please consider Mr. Almost if he falls in this category and stop trying to always do better. Dating isn't like going shopping for a new pair of shoes or something. Just we're all human, so try to give him a pass and see what develops. The second and more dangerous kind of Mr. Almost is Mr. Deal Breaker. This guy is just not right for you and you know it, but you can't seem to let him go and you're just holding on and hoping he changes or it gets better and the odds are very slim that that will actually happen. When it comes down to a deal breaker, Mr. Almost, it's time to let him go. Either way, you do have some choices to make with Mr. Almost. Give the deal breaker guy the boot, probably, and give the Mr. I'm not perfect guy, give him a real chance, especially if he loves you and you can see that he has everything else that you want. I hope this helps you deal with Mr. Almost. Thanks for watching.